Hello everyone, it's Prue here at Southern Satin. I'm coming today to make, um, I'm making a few soaps today, um, small one pound batches to test out a few fragrances. Right now I'm doing Chocolate and Amber from Nature's Garden Candles. Let me just read you the description as I think it smells delightful, but I can never explain it. So it says, a warm heart of sandalwood and patchouli that blends with jasmine blossoms, rich undertones of musk, are sweetened with precious amber and hints of vanilla. A lingering accent of cocoa bean creates a heady twist for this scent. So that's the description online. And it just smells so chocolatey and musky and I love it. So let me just buzz up my oils really quickly. I have my oats and my milk and aloe in here. Let me buzz it up. I'm soaping at about 95 degrees. Oh, and um, this does discolor. I'm not sure how much. It, it says to a, um, a light brown, I think it says, a light beige. But you never know. So I'm going to leave some of it uncolored. And some of it is going to be this 24 karat gold mica from Nature's Garden Candles. And some of it is going to be um, this mocha brown mica from Nurture Soap. So let's get this lie in here and let's get soaping. Feels good to be soaping again. I've been making soap regularly again on a weekly basis. Let me rinse this out because I need this for the chocolate color. Put this mocha in here. Oops. Now let me buzz up this batter. Just a little. Here we go with this thickness. And you know, this cord pisses me off. I wish it was longer. I should have put the fragrance in before I did that. When I'm testing, I like to put the fragrance in the whole thing. I know that's dangerous, but I like to see exactly how it behaves. So let's do that now. And I'll hand stir it. <clears throat> I'll blend it again with the mixer once I split off the colors. I don't see any ricing. Mm, it smells so good. Okay, let me split off the colors. That's representing the chocolate. This is representing the amber. And then we gotta leave some uncolored just to see exactly how much it's going to discolor. Okay. Let's get back to stick blending. Sorry, it's probably gonna be out of frame. <laughs> Gold. 
Let's do the mocha. Now we can go ahead and pour. I think I'll just do a drop swirl. Why? Because I don't have my, um, I didn't get my hanger tool, my gear tie. And it's pretty fluid still, so. So yeah, we can do it. Just a drop swirl. Start with the plain soap. Let's get to the chocolate. Ooh. Always gotta make a mess. Gold. If I make this again, I probably wouldn't even bother with the plain. I just use the, the mocha and gold. Just want to see what it's gonna, how it's gonna discolor. Now it's getting a little thick, but when there's such a little bit left in the measuring cup, it usually gets thick regardless, so it's hard to tell. Okay, I'm going to bang this down, and then I'm going to come back and do something with the top. I'm not going to swirl it or anything. Maybe I should. Maybe I could do a spoon swirl. I'll be right back. Yeah, I think I'm going to try a spoon swirl. Whoa! Yeah, it's getting thick in there. What the hell? It's like a big lump right there. Oh, no. Okay, that's enough. Okie dokie. Let's get the rest of this soap on top. Holy sh crap. <laughs> frizzle, frazzle. Ah, I forgot to put my super fat in. Isn't that lovely? Well. Oh, man. That's okay. I still do a, a small discount. So, that's alright. But, damn it. See, that's why I like to just put it all, everything in at once. So then you can't forget. Well, oh, okay, now I'm slinging soap. Why? Because I'm frustrated because I forgot my super fat. Even though the soap will still be fine, it's just not, you know, what I wanted. So, that's annoying. I'm sure you soapers understand. 
what I'm feeling right now. Okay. I don't know. I didn't get a chopstick. Let me just smash this some kind of way. I don't care. All right, that's it. That is my chocolate and amber. Thank you for watching and catch me on the cut. Hey everybody, I'm back to cut my chocolate and amber soap. It's been two days and it still smells very good. This was, I believe, a spoon swirl. Still kind of soft. Oh! <laughs> that just scared me. No, it didn't. Okay, let me cut off an end piece. Oh, spoons. That looks cool. Okay. Thank you for watching. See you next time.